Hey guys, um, so I'm finally doing another super cool things in this video. It's been a really long time and I'm really sorry. It's just been crazy with moving back into school and whatever. Um, but this is my last semester of college, of school, potentially ever. <laughs> it's a little weird. It's my last semester, which is crazy. Um, I can't believe I'll be leaving uh, Monterey in a few weeks. It's just, I can't even believe it. So anyway, um, something I can believe in is reading off the super cool things list. So. Um, to start off, um, I had a favorite movie this week because I actually did watch Royal Tenenbaums with uh, my parents before I left for uh, school. Uh, it was hilarious. It was so funny. Um, Bill Murray is in it. Um, Gwyneth Paltrow, like young Gwyneth Paltrow. And both Owen Wilson and his brother, who just let me say I did not know Owen Wilson had a brother, but I certainly know Owen Wilson has a brother now. There is a suicide trigger warning or attempted suicide trigger warning, so just you know, be prepared. My favorite uh, music album right now is um, Taylor Swift's Reputation. I know, you either really you either really like it or you really hate it. And honestly, I, I love it. I've been listening to it on repeat for like months now, um, which is kind of sad, but whatever. Um, I also got the Ed Sheeran CD. It's really good too. Um, I haven't listened to very much Ed Sheeran before, so I'm still kind of getting used to him. Um, but I really like Castle on a Hill and I love Galway Girl. Oh my god. Uh, but all those supermarket flowers. Supermarket flowers? I think that's what it's called. The last one. Oh, tears. And my favorite song is New Year's Day, uh, off of Reputation. Um, it's just really, it's really mellow, really sweet. Um, I think it kind of combines, um, old Taylor Swift songs where, you know, she's, um, they're more like traditional love songs and, um, new Taylor because it still has that element of like, you know, we're young and we're partying and we live it up in New York. Like it's the, it's a nice mix of them. I recently read the book, The Sergeant's Cat by Jan van de Wetting, uh, which is, um, Dutch, I assume. Um, he writes this series. Um, about um, Amsterdam cops and um, I am not gonna try to pronounce their names. <laughs> this is uh, The Sergeant's Cat. It's a collection of Amsterdam cop stories and it was being sold at my local bookstore for um, the sale price and so I was like all right I'll check it out um, and it is so good. The characters are really endearing. Um, they give them real like personalities like you keep finding different elements to these characters and that's what I really like. Um, but it doesn't get lost in the character's personal lives. It really uh, is a good balance between the cop's stories and the cop story, if that makes sense. This is a collection of short stories, but this same author did um, an entire series on the main adjunct and his uh, sergeant. And um, this is the first one. It's called An Outsider in Amsterdam. And it's uh, really, really good. Um, I really like it so far. This novel is definitely different, um, but it still keeps with that theme of a nice balance. Um, the short stories is just a little faster paced. So if you like mysteries or detective stories, but not the super long winded, you know, um, explanations of things, uh, you know, if you kind of just wish that Poirot would get to the point. <laughs> my new favorite gadget is um, my record player. Um, I would show it to you, but it's currently sitting under some boxes over there. Um, but they sell them at Target. Um, and mine is cherry red. It's a Victorola. And it's nothing fancy. Um, it's like, they're, they're selling them now. They're like Bluetooth enabled, so you can use the speakers that come with it to play music off your phone. And they also come with an audio jack so you can plug your phone in. Um, and they come with a line out uh, jack so I can plug my um, my speakers in. My friend Melissa also has one. We're both looking to buy more records. I have the Ingrid Michaelson record. Um, it doesn't have to make sense. And I also just ordered the Reputation vinyl. But she's got a ton. She's got uh, like Pink Floyd. She's a huge Pink Floyd fan. Um, she's got uh, Prince and the Lion King soundtrack because of course. So my favorite new project, I'm super excited about this you guys and I'm gonna make a whole other video so I won't go into too much detail here. But um, my new favorite project is um, uh, Giovanni and I set up this uh, Discord server um, for all of our friends who are content creators because there are a lot of us and when we just started it there were like 10 of us already. I decided since I already have uh, a significant otter um, I would make a website for us but I'll go back more into it in the post about it but 
Um, I'm super excited. Gio's girlfriend, Mary, um, just started a YouTube channel. I'm so excited. She just put her first video out. It's called Plan With Me February. Oh my God, it's so good, you guys. I'm, I, I, I love everything about it. I ordered a bullet journal and um, Mary's channel is gonna be about bullet journaling and organization and stuff. So I'm definitely looking forward to learning from her. Um, my journal isn't here yet, um, but when it uh, when it is, it'll probably be in the next video. Um, but it's it's got like this pretty painting on it by Van Gogh. I think it's called Green Ears of Wheat, um, which is ironic, Van Gogh ears. <laughs> Please go check out Mary. I'll put her uh, channel in the description. And go check out G10 Gaming. He's putting out a couple of new videos. Um, his most recent one that he's uploaded, I believe as of the airing of this video, is um, Meme to Death, uh, which is a Fortnite montage. All the guys that I game with like ganged up on me and made me download Fortnite. So I'll be putting out a Fortnite video at some point in the future. We also all just downloaded Astroneer. Oh my God, you guys, it's so pretty like this is a gorgeous gorgeous game and i know i just said like oh my god you guys it's so pretty but bear with me the the art style is very well suited to the kind of game it is um you you've got to go check it out i don't think it's particularly expensive um it was gifted to me by um a very good friendo that's all i've got for super cool things list january 25th i know i wrote this in january it's coming out in february but it's less than a month this time I'll be putting out another super cool things list once I have enough for a post, and I'll catch you guys all in the next video. Thanks so much. Mm -hmm.